Betty White's comedic career seemed eternal. In her late 80s, she wooed a new generation of fans who campaigned for her to host Saturday Night Live. And now I'm here tonight because you wanted me to be. It was a classic skit where a seemingly sweet old lady suddenly spices things up. If I could, I would, I would take you all on a big hayride. <laughs> Starting with you, sir. No, not you. You. <clears throat> her television career began in her 20s, but really took off decades later when she took on the role of the caustic Sue Nivens in the Mary Tyler Moore show. That's the camera. When the red light goes on, that means that the camera is about... I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Just cue me and then stick a sock in it. <laughs> then a sitcom about four older women became an unlikely runaway hit. Betty White playing the naive widow Rose, who drove housemates batty with absurdities about her beloved hometown. It's not that easy to make new friends. It sure wasn't for the first Eskimo family that moved to St. Olaf. <laughs> Today, tributes flowed for a trailblazer who always stole the show. Comedian Seth Meyers said Betty White was the only SNL host I ever saw get a standing ovation at the after party. Ryan Reynolds, whom she starred alongside in the 2009 film The Proposal, said the world looks different now. She managed to grow very old and somehow not old enough. Betty White died a couple of weeks shy of her 100th birthday. She would certainly have had something funny to say about that.